Hey guys, just making a short video of this driver board. It's an HY-TB4DV-S1. You can find these all over eBay. And uh, I really like this driver board. It's much better than the previous versions of this board that you can find all over eBay. Uh, you'll notice these ones here, they have this uh, orangey peachy colored uh, connector and the other ones the old style are the green ones and uh, you'll notice here you know it's much different if you see the other style with the green connectors stay away from that board they're piles of crap anyway um, the problem with this board now they still haven't fixed the problems is these two pins on this side here they're in a normally closed position so the problem is they don't give you a third pin option. Normally they'll have normally open, normally closed, and a center pin. Well, this one doesn't have it. All it has is a normally closed. So anyways, the problem is with this is if you hook up a, you know, a spindle router or even a plasma control, you know, you want to turn on the torch, you're going to have a problem because if you turn off the control, it's instantly going to, turn the uh, unit on um, you know even if you toggle the active high on uh, on mock in the in the settings um, you know you can fix it in the control but the problem is once you shut off that control then it's going to turn the spindle on or plasma on or whatever you want to use this for so I'm going to post some still photos of the repair that I've done to this board the relay has to be desoldered off the PC board and two traces need to be cut and this jumper wire needs to be soldered there so when you turn the spindle on or fire the torch then these two pins become active and then when you shut it off these pins are open anyways take a look at the photos that I'm posting here and hopefully this helps you out if you're having an issue with this board. Anyways, have a great day.